All right, everyone, welcome back to Stardew Gaming and the new episode of the Realms of Arcania, Star Trail. Um, last time we did that battle against the orcs, and most of the time I was also battling some uh, sickness on Kaya. But everything is good now. Um, I found this tailor here in Hill House, and I was about to, or I did some inventory management in between episodes. I, however, found I still have stuff to sell, like empty bottles like a couple more food items just going to do that quickly before we head off to our further journey i'm not sure why arbush was so heavily overloaded he was probably complaining all the time that he has to carry so much stuff um vidaria was overloaded because she was carrying basically 100 um uh tarnals right so i solved that i found that the red lunar disc actually gives you a bonus on courage so I have 17 Courage now, but a um, uh, minus one on Charisma, that's not so good. What I also did, I found that tailor, and I got Kaya some new ropes, and I got um, Arik some new ropes, just because I like that. So I did not investigate these items. I also have the liquor bottles that I need to sell. No, wait a second, should I keep those? Hang on, maybe I should keep all those bottles for alchemy, in case, you know, I ever have time for this stuff. So, here is another bottle. Yeah, maybe I should not throw that stuff away. Just the food. Uh, where is it? Yeah, 12 food there. Also got a lot of potions still. And I'm good on arrows as well. And I'm so good on tunnels. Oh, wait a second, that's not current tunnel. It's gone moon. But I have 100 tunnels here, and so basically 130 tunnels. I will never use those. Yeah, probably not. So why don't I sell the entire stack? Well, because it's not worth anything. Good. Anyway, let's just do it. There you go. Get some money out of it. And it's a new day. Yes, it is. Please let me know if you got that reference. All right, so there is a sign oops, uh, there is a signpost supposedly. So is it this? Yeah, that's the signpost. Let's continue on the road. I could go back and explore this piece of way, or I could go back here, or even use the parallel of way through the wilderness. Or I do, I do it all. I do first this. Oh, you can actually schedule Oh, that is so sexy. That was not... Po yeah, well, it was possible in the old game. A break would be a good idea. Well, let's make a break then. What time do we have? 6 p.m. Good. 6 p.m. is just fine. 14 rations yet again. All right. And Kaya, you go for some herbs. How about three hours? She didn't find anything. I'm good on the watches, and then six hours of sleep, and we continue on the journey. Are we there yet? I think we are. Yeah. You see a young bear playing on a lush meadow. There are no signs of his mother anywhere. Do you enrich the food supplies with some fresh bear meat? <laughs> That's cruel. I don't need food supplies, right? I could do this, but ugh, let me just leave it alone. Plus, I think um, that my, ooh, got another achievement. You see, for all that traveling. Oh, that's interesting. I'm not sure I remember this path. So let's go this way and see if we can find ourselves some wood elves. There you go. There's the female bear. That is the ugliest female bear that I have ever seen in my entire life. 
Seriously, that is really ugly. <laughs> uh, she obviously is pretty mad. Um, and I'm going to get the heck away. Now, let's see. You run fast as you can, but the bear is getting closer. Torfin is desperately grasping for breath. His armor is slowing him down. Yeah, obviously. I guess he's falling back. No doubt the bear will have caught up with Torfin soon. Do you keep running? Torfin's already feeling the bear's hot breath on... Ugh. Another dialogue error. And I'm going to report all those those bugs that I find, right? Immediately the bear stops because there was the cry of the bear pup. Now, just imagine I had killed the bear pup, right? I really need some rest. Yeah, let's let's make some rest here. <laughs> that was close. Uh, I'm not going to take those. And Kaya go for herbs for two hours. She cannot find anything. Let's have some sleep and some battle. Uh, that is a mountain lion. Okay. Well, here. Mountain lion. I'm not Core sure. Core is laughing! If you like this. Oh, Torfin was crushed down. I don't like this. And you can do it again. Yeah. Fail. The good thing about uh, being attacked or Torfin being attacked is he's got plenty of armor. Arbush can help. You are all going to die. To hell with you. To hell with you. Torfin was crushed down again and the armor basically absorbs all the damage. I like it. <laughs> I do like it. Uh, Vidariel, can you take him out? No, you can hit him, but you can't take him out. That's fine, though. Eight damage. Wow, that is one tough lion, I would say. Him. Still a live lion. Not going to waste any magic energy on you. Die faster so I can get my next foe. That seemed to be a critical. 16 damage. Nice. Looks really good. I have no idea where you get there. Probably can go down Sleep. here then. Again? Yeah, because we were so rudely interrupted, right? Uh-oh. Okay, there was nothing. That's some movement. I'm going to fall asleep standing. Yeah, yeah it's fine. I'm not going to take more food with me, but Vindariel is... Remember the first days when she didn't find anything and I was freaking out? Now she's finding too much. But I won't complain, it's fine. So, Kaya... Hang on. Is that the actual clothing you wear? Hey, look at this. That's the actual... I like this. That is nice. That you can wear the actual clothing. Pretty cool. Just noticed. So Kaya, go for some herbs. Yoruga and Tarnal. All right, all right. And now we can go through sleep. Eight hours should be fine. Almond. The little forest elf will that is not Vindariel's home village. I want to point that out. So in case you were hoping, Vindariel's home village is way, way over here to the east, right? That's just a small portion of the Salamander Stones. And um, Vindariel's village is way over to the east. A woman on a moose, a petite woman on the back of a moose approaches and without stopping... Not to you in a friendly manner. What? Sleep. Why would I want to sleep again? Let's continue on our path. I'm going to search for... So, wait a second. There was a woman on a moose. 
I like a moose. That's all you need. Find something edible and some water. Oh, I got elm leaves. Let's get all high here. Yoruga and four leafed one berry. See, it's leafed one berry. Okay. Let's get 10 hours of sleep and then continue. I need to go over here as well. And there is, I think that's sleep. Nova. Yeah, sure. More rain. What is this? I got 99 Hylian fire. Something is wrong with that. Where, where did I get that? No, it's one. It's just wrong numbering there. I can pick up those rations. And... Oh, Dull Moon, Tarnal, more Elm Leaves. That's nice. Let's go for sleep. Vendariel's head feels as if it's packed in cotton. So Kaya needs to heal her. No, that's Gashok. All right, so that is a long way down. Could probably go with some... He reached a small elvish village in the wooded hills of the Salamander Stones. Do you want to talk to an elf woman, stick her head out of a cabin, or leave the village right away? Let's talk to the elf woman, right? Um, let's talk about the Salamander Stones. That's our home. Strangers are not allowed here, because once we allow them to spread to this area, things will soon be as bad as the Salamander Stones as in other places. That is true. And Vindariel, probably at these words, is like, yeah, she's right. Let's leave. Let's hear about the Dwarven Pit if she knows about that. You should ask a question like this in this place. Yeah, maybe not. Do you know about the Salamander Stone by any chance? Um, this artifact is in the possession of the elves and it shall remain this. Uh, well, I'm not sure she's speaking the truth. Do you know about Star Trail? Sorry, she does not. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Let's end the conversation and then go over here. Oh, look at this, rain. Okay, Kaya can try to heal the Daryl. And she was not successful? Hang on a second. Oh, it's only eight. Yeah, okay. I can tell that. Look at all this rain. That sucks so bad. Go for eight hours of sleep and then continue on the road. Hey, you there! You hear the female voice from behind your backs. When you turn around, you see the moose rider come galloping towards you. I just wanted to tell you that you can really ride these beasts, even though I don't think anyone beside me actually does. With that, she turns her fiery steed around and disappears. Well, that was odd. <laughs> It's fine. And we're making good progress to one berries. Let's take them. Oh, look at this. Vendaria leveled up. Sleep. I will do that immediately. All right. No, I don't want to level up automatically. She gained six points. And I will do it like this. Hang on. She already has 49 astral energy. Let's go... Yeah, let's go full life energy then. 
and as for her stats, she's really very average. Um, I'm gonna go with strength. And now I'm gonna try this. Do you want to split the leveling attempts? No, 25 25 is fine. What do you want to improve? Ah, uh, well, definitely projectile weapons. I mean, that's like her basic skill, right? And swords. Um, not gonna put that on attack. But on parry. Um, track and survival, obviously. Orientation. Sure. Go with treat diseases twice. And these two. I'm really on a roll here. Um, body control and swimming. Now the spells. So, I will go with the Somnigravis, and then obviously with these, with these three, some Balm of Healing. I want to do Eagle Eye, and there was another one, a transformation spell that she is really bad at, the Eagle of Wolf. I'm not sure why I never raised that. It doesn't make a lot of sense, but well. That's what I did. We didn't do food yet, did we? Ah, here you can pick him up. And Kaya can try to treat the disease. And fail. Miserably. <sighs> that is not good. And we got a battle. Wow. Wow. Um, another mountain lion? That is fine. So, Chirin, you go here. And give him a good... Or not. <laughs> Because you fail. That's fine though. Um, well, oh, look at this. Vendariel's movement is really limited. Because she's down to. Core is laughing! Seven. Yeah, she's at seven or so strength, right? Okay, that was only one hit against the lion. And Torfin is now down on the floor. Go here. Can you shoot from here? You can. I'm not sure if she's gonna hit anything. Oh! <laughs> of course. Well, you know, she's like out uh, and running nose and dull skull, but eight damage. That's fine. Welcome to Boron's Empire! 24. I break every single bone of yours! Yeah. <laughs> These two hits, they probably did that. I mean, seriously. So I could try to get out of the... But I'm not gonna. Um, so I'm trying to get to Gashok and to the south. Right? So let's go here. Either way, we will rest now or I will... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rest now. Now, um, Kaya, try again to treat Vindariel. Oh, come on. That's unreal. And she's sick now as well. What does she have? Oh, you, you need one. Yeah, here. Just take a tunnel or so. Damn it. Uh spreading. I hate when that happens. Don't need to take this stuff. I need to get to Gashok. I hope I can make that. 
And well, it's still a long way. But I can take this road. And maybe I can't. What is that? This sort of heat is just unbearable in winter clothes, as quite clear from the sweat on the faces of Torfin, Shireen, Arbash, Vindariel, number four, whatever that is. Um, <laughs> um, winter clothes while traveling. So I'm sorry, but um, I, I really want to make sure that we get a good gaming experience. So it might be a translation bug. Only the undead don't need to... <sighs> Shall we remove the winter cloaks? Yeah, let's, let's remove the winter coats from the people for now. We can put them back on. But after all that rain, you know... Good. Now, let's try again. You will try to treat Vindariel and you fail. You will try to treat Kaya and you will fail. Oh, shit. And then let's all go to sleep. No battle in the night, I like that. But overall, I'm concerned with this. Yeah, we will I'm going avoid to fall asleep that. standing up if we're not going to take a break soon. So what just happened, and I clicked too fast, I was, I'm sorry, but that buzzing made me nervous. Um, there is some swamp area around here. And there was a... Uh, buzzing of insects. Now, buzzing of insects in the dark eye or the realms of Arcania is if the GM wants to really um, screw with you, is Bobberat mosquitoes. And Bobberat mosquitoes are just normal mosquitoes, but they don't drink blood. They drink XP. So you lose experience when they attack you. And that is like really dangerous. Now, Let's make a break here and see if Windariel is able to treat this. She's not. Let's see if Kaya is able to treat this and she's not. I am really... <laughs> How good are you with treating diseases? You could try it. So let me... Uh, let me give you a tunnel. I think you will get one or two. Alright, make yourself useful. Alright, she cannot be healed twice a day or try to be. I don't want to keep this. Let's see if we can do that a little bit later. Yeah, now can only do it twice, uh, once a day. Damn it. It's really bad. <laughs> this is really bad. Um, a peddler. Hey, my loves. Can the good Janda inspire you? So a small exchange business, herbs, hero ingredients, and daily needed goods of excellent quality. And for my Northland savior, at excellent prices. Just look into my modest offer. We will talk about the price later once you have picked something. Oh, well, let's have a look at what she has got. Oh, she's got some herbs. I don't need a sickle. I have one. Um, what do we get here? A yellowed parchment? I'm not sure what that means. Dried whirlweeds? Yeah, I will... Definitely, I will definitely pick that up. And finash, I will definitely pick that up. That's not something you can buy anywhere, right? Normally. 
So, 28 ducats? What? 32? 32 ducats for... Well, it's a finash, right? Nah, it's fine. I, I have plenty of money, and these two items... I'm going to search for another available. grave if we're not going... So now, let's see if Alric can treat Kaya. No, he cannot. Let's see if Kaya can treat Vindariel. Oh, she's not sick anymore. Look at this. When did that happen? Okay, cool. Now, next day, and that's awesome. <laughs> That is really good. That means that next day I can focus on trying to heal Kaya with hopefully Vindariel if her. I steps really need recover. some rest. Oh, that's too early. <laughs> Got three achievements at once for Wayfarer. Uh, Wayfarer 1, 2, 3, and 4. Wow. Okay, uh, let's go over here and see if we can get to Gashok. Just leave me here. I can't. Nah, we will not leave you here. Now, let me have a quick look at Vindariel's stats. They look good again, but she does not have any herbs. So let's just give her like six Golmoon. And now let's see if she is able to treat this. Oh, a gold moon is the one the, the one herb that does not help here. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Let's give her some one berries. If that does the trick. Vindariel, treat disease. And she was successful. So finally everyone is back on the road again. And that means we can go for some fourteen rations, and then um, Kaya can go for two hours. Look for herbs, and she's she finds the one berries. No, I don't want to leave those behind. I want to take them, and let's go for eight hours of sleep. And then continue on the road. Um, got cartographer achievements. However, I'm not going there just yet. Uh, I kind of remember that you need to go there at some point. But I want to go to Gashok first. Six one berries. Here, you pick them up. I'm going to fall asleep standing up if we're not going to take... Nah, uh, not yet. Looking at it from here, the small town of Gashok looks thoroughly romantic. Obviously, looks can be deceiving. Oh yeah, they can. And I am getting into a battle, which I'm not going to resolve in this episode. You will have to wait until in two days when I meet you again for some more Realms of Arcania Star Trail. Until then, I'm Stordir. Bye.